chair of the Missouri Republican Party, uh, Ann Wagner, as well as current chair of the Missouri Democratic Party, Susan Monte. Ann Wagner, everybody wants to know, will you be challenging the senior senator, Claire McCaskill, in 2012? Now, you you know, Michael, I couldn't possibly announce with Mike, or with Mark Reardon gone. He would absolutely have all of our heads <laughs> as we were sitting right here. Now, um, you know, I, I continue to look very seriously at this race. I had a great Lincoln Days, statewide Lincoln Days in Springfield last weekend. And, and really what this is about is a, a decision about um, who can really articulate our, our views uh, to take on Claire McCaskill in the, in the best way, who can raise the money, who can reach out to the grassroots, new and old, who can articulate our message, and who can lead us to victory in 2012 and finish the job. So um, if, if I'm that person, um, uh, I will certainly be announcing, and I will certainly wait until Mark Reardon comes back to, to do so. <laughs> Susan Monte, uh, is the fact that Ann Wagner's still trying to figure this out uh, a testament to how good of a senator Claire McCaskill's been? Well, I think so. I, th- I think in addition to that, you look at everyone else who's looked at it and and decided not to i mean you had you know congressman sam graves and and joanne emerson take a, a hard look at it and say oh no i'm going to pass i i think claire has done a, a really good job and and the fact that uh on any given day the republicans and the democrats can be mad at her just proves that uh she's right for missouri she's uh she's been an independent voice for us and and you know this She's uh, not always, um, you know, straight party line on anything, and and that's okay. She's got she's been fiscally conservative all along, and I think it's the the auditor background and the prosecutor background has really uh, done her well in the Senate. Ann Wagner, you're in the midst of convulsions. Oh Please my share. heavens, yes. Uh, let me set the record straight here. I, I just begin to. You know, I think the only the only thing that uh, that Claire McCaskill is independent of in the state is uh, is the voters of Missouri. To be perfectly honest. Uh, now, not only uh, I kind of coined her Chameleon Claire at our Lincoln Days last weekend, and I've never seen anyone turn uh, colors and stripes so differently in in, in all my days. Uh, she's uh, for it when she's in in Missouri, and she's against it when she's back in Washington D.C. Just this week on Social Security, she stood and talked about when she was in Missouri about the fact that there needed to be entitlement reform on Social Security. Then she sends out a fundraising letter saying that she will veto any attempt to ever. Uh, uh, <laughs> cut the budget and 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 uh, go about uh, these kinds of, of discussions in a in a grown-up legislative fashion it's very important that we have a, a change in leadership that's reflective i think of our state